Alright, what is up you guys and welcome back to of course part 2 of the Naslock Of the... no But yeah, I mean we are now going for the dice, we actually got 5 That means that we're going to go to the 5th pelt of grass we get to catch a Pokemon Basically the intentions here is that we only get the chance to um, go to these areas I do believe twice and um, Believe it or not, but um, even though there's plenty of areas to catch different types of Pokemon here, it is kind of hard to be decisive about um, which Pokemon to get, and more in the Nuzlocke how to function with it. So I recognize that it was better to do just a throw on these, just basically so don't get overwhelmed by different types of Pokemon, and also just to keep the, the challenges in check, that is. So, um... We get stuff from her, I guess. Cool. Come on, let me go. That one would be the fifth. So, the grass on the left here, I guess, is the area we can catch a Pokemon on. Okay, give us something good. What do we get? Oh, Whopper, really? That's kind of disappointing. <laughs> oh, and level 11. That's not going to help. Payback, I guess? As much as possible. Rain has. Okay, man. You do you. Now we're faster. What did he do? War gun. Oh, he's going to absolutely kill us. So Whopper was a bit of a disappointment. Mud shot. I guess the only positive part about this is that uh, we get a really strong potential Pokemon. If he doesn't kill us, that is. <laughs> Hope we can get him. Oh no. He's fighting back. Need to wheel him down a bit more. I mean, this guy could absolutely kill us. Plus, he could have War Absorb, and that would be very, very unfortunate. Really glad I haven't uh, tail slapped me or mud shot me a few times already. Because these Pokemon, because they're a higher level than me, they are absolutely a lot tougher to catch. Which I think shows. Stay in the ball, Whopper. Stay. There you go. Cool. I can do Whopper. So what are we going to call you? No. No Fanta. I'm gonna call you No Fanta. Why? God knows right. why. On to Hammerlock. I think this was Hammerlock. And I believe I only have one route in between the grass gym, so you know I, we're we're not looking necessarily all that stellar. Motorstoke. I knew that. Yeah, what if honestly? So, what do I need to refill on? Daylight? Yeah. 
Jag eh, gör eh, en sån här nasslock som heter. Mm. Så jag spelar igenom spelet utan att eh, någon Pokémon ska dö. Jaha, nej för jag tyckte att du sa, ja det får du, men så blev jag så osäker så jag bara kan inte det. <laughs> det kan vara så att du, hamnar, att du blir med lite nu, men det tror jag inte gör något. <laughs> Kanske gör lite grann. <laughs> Vad sa du? Det dumma mest. Mm. Ska ni vara kvar eller ska ni hänga med mig? Mm, jag verkar chilla. Mm, Hej. And that was a miss, Skyrender. So alright, I believe we should only go up here, I think. Let's see, we're gonna do... I was gonna do them both, hair and makeup. Let's see, we do the hair first. They got a lot of, like, hairstyles out, didn't they? I like this one, this is clearly thick. Long and straight, that sounds about right. Oh, the pixie cut was kind of cool. They even got like extra stuffy stuff there. Huh. Blue, red, pink. White? These colors make no sense to me. I am always blue. Now I look like a crazy person. And I'm okay with it. Hat should be on. It's not even a question. Hat on. Now I'm gonna do my browns. Thick. And blue. And cat eye, doll eyes, what? Okay. And they are gonna be lovely hearts. And my lips are gonna be blue. Uh, it doesn't look right. Red will do. Pink. I go. So many options. You know, you you pick male, and they're like, yeah, you get stuff. But here, you know, here I went all out. I'm way behind these. This looks great. I just need a purple hat. This is the fire gym, yeah, I remember. Gym ish. Oh yeah, and that's a purple guy who becomes the fairy shenanigans. I mean, you already get that kind of vibe on him. He's called Braid or something like that, right? I mean, that looks scarier already. <coughs> And my number should be 017. The year my daughter was born. By the way, did you know that Rose Shaman has a story arc in um, the books that aren't showcased? The reason why he wanted to, um, I guess, destroy the world. They talk about some type of power shortage that he wanted to prevent it before it actually happened. Um, whether or not he wanted it, to, like that's gonna happen like thousand years in the future. Uh, whether or not that was the case is actually for debate, or if it was gonna happen sooner. If people, uh, sorry, if people are keeping Dynamaxing because it would actually go into you abuse a lot of power. Basically, this event is going to take place in thousands of years. It's going to happen sooner. And he wanted to try to prevent that by actually using the Turnitus, who um, spread these Dynamax uh, crystals or Lucky Stars, or Star Piece, I guess it's called. Um, 
but they failed to execute that and just loops I'm not gonna say weird but I feel like it's hard to understand what the purpose is so go through all these like gym leaders I believe the water type is going to be alright. Um, Ghost and Fairy is going to be rough. Fire is going to be an absolute blast. Ice is going to be okay. Ish. Dragon is dragon. And, uh, I mean, Leon has everything else. He's even a dragon bolt. <laughs> How scary is that? I think that's kind of wicked. Why would I actually enforce the best trainer that has charge sword and just brag about that? Why would uh, he have a Dragapult? That's, that's clearly the demand you want to brag about. I'm, I'm sorry, but Charizard is just... Yeah, I mean, sure, cool. Because a fire starter can fly, but, you know, a Dragapult? I'm sorry, that's in a different league, buddy. But, but this one can Dynamax into an alternative form. Yep. But it isn't a Dragapult. Or an Aegis Slash, for that matter. so annoying. So right, his Wulu is clearly stronger. Let's see if it's very tackle. It's gonna do a lot. Payback is gonna do a lot more. I hope it did, but not the way I wanted to, or not as much as I wanted to. But still, you know, I'm clearly hitting hard here. Coward. Alright, cool. Get him out of the way. I am well whittled down though. Oh, water pulls. Now you're just begging for it. Here it comes, Ghost Bunny. At level 14, that's. That's fair. Um, <laughs> that's not good. <clears throat> Bit of overpowered there, buddy. Bit of overpowered. Let's see, tackle. I did damage. I hope for confusion, I guess. That's unnecessary. Oh. Oh, what? Super effective hit? No, you shouldn't. Okay. Growl. Good. We needed that. Field score spawn is kind of... Um, level 14 is kind of pushing it. No Fanta level up. No Fanta learn mist. How about that? And learn haste. Cool. Don't need any of them. Rockety. Thing is, they're so low HP. Do you want to stay into this? It was a growl after all, not there. Cool. Impact us. We're good. Take him down. Take him down, Ashton. There I go. Cool. A Magigant is gonna evolve to a Dottler and not gonna be able to attack anything. <sighs> but at least evolve, like, you get plenty of defense. Which is really alright. And reflect, and light screen, and confusion. You know what? It it feels good, even though it isn't. I have no idea. But we got one benefit: new area, new Pokemon. 
I do not want a six again. Give me something good. Oh, my job. That's kind of alright, isn't it? Can I take with confusion? I could almost kill it. Revenge? Don't think so. Hey, cool. I'm actually... I'm kind of happy with that. My chop is always good. My show is going to be a different type of a violet Pokemon, I'm sure. And we're going to name you... Let's see, male or female? Male. Your name is Gaius. I guess a Growlithe would have been better. <laughs> At least I could have evolved that one, but... Hell, my joke is cool. Let's see, Vulpix. What level are you on? I'm not gonna have an easy game. Or I, I've, I'm feeling it already. Let's see, Quick Attack. Eventually gonna absolutely sting you. Jesus, okay, cool. That's... My chop is absolutely here. I'm I'm sorry, lass. That's just that's just how it is. I got a chop and he chopped. Oh, I really wish I could have got myself. Um, we'll see how I do. I mean, if I get him to a machoke, I kind of want to push him for a jump. But maybe I should be able to trade him with somebody. Come on, school girl Hannah. What do you got? Pancham. Okay. Level 13. We are faster. Suck Don't tell me. Oh no, Gaius! No. 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 Really? That's awful. I lost Gaius within within minutes. All right, first casualty. But my chop, I just started to envisionize as a potential machamp. Oh, that's rough. That really sucks. Did not see that one coming. Schoolboy Peter, you have a Sislipede. That could be a problem. I hate when the residuals are doing more than actual attack. Water pulse should knock it out. There we go. Oh, you got a doctor on your own. Well, he's got one water pulse on him. Damn, it actually broke through, didn't it? Coward. I think I should kill anyway. No, nope, we're close. Boo. Ah, I must be able to kill it. Come on. Right? Yeah? Hmm? Oof. That did not feel as still as I wanted to. Ooh. That could turn ugly. Hey, Sobble! Cool. 
Drisili? Okay. Barely remember that name. But I take it. That's good. Um, do you have any way of recovering myself from here? Besides grabbing a super potion? Thank you for that. So right through the cave. I actually think I'm gonna have no fan in the front, but at least it is able to fend for itself a little bit better. Here's a TM Rock Blast. Don't believe I have any Pokemon that can capitalize on that either. Nope. Not surprised, just disappointed. I was kind of hoping I would see, like, some dust of sand just that uh, was a random encounter. Oh, timber, that's... That's kind of pushing it. Level 14. Sounds like mud shot to me. Low kick. Ooh. Took it. Oh, it did. Yeah, it was like, that did a lot, but it turns out it was crit. Of course it was. No way is Whopper able to fend off itself that well. I find it a bit frustrated. I actually switched out Dotler because I didn't think it had uh, an offensive merits with so many rock types. Then next encounter is a fire type. Like, yeah, thank you for that. Damn it, Gaius. Stop leveling up. You're just making it harder. Another timber. <laughs> Alright, we can do one, but two is pushing it. Wow. We're gonna rely on Dothler for this lead gem, I'm sure. That critic could have been helpful before, but right, I'll take it. Right, the timber slaughter. Ooh. Where did that come from? Hate to see it. Okay, so I want to give a potion to uh, Whopper. I do want to keep Whopper on front. It doesn't seem like there are random encounters. Oh, another team. Scary face. That's also kind of disappointing. Ah, heavy jeet boots. I'm going to trade that one over to my game. Do I got a value? I guess so.
kind of forgot about him. Bade. Bead. Solosis. So not so much fairy. Level 13, that's alright. I think we can do this. Oh yeah, it's okay. It's kind of feeling I was under leveled. Then again, it was only one of his Pokemon. Next one is Gothia. So not super impressive. Ooh, stockpile. Also good. I guess we can give up payback after all. No. No swallow, and then no spit up. Alright, last Pokemon from your team is Hattany. So he's starting off really weak. Ish. Of course he got me confused. Um I'm not gonna take that risk. And I think Dazzler should have well enough HP to deal with this. Round, that's gonna do a lot more. And there we go. So, cool, but we are, we are absolutely can do this easily. I'm not even going to recover my team, okay? Thank you for that. Put this episode down a little bit. I'm just going to see if them quote, exploit do work. Or it's not an exploit, it's just you're able to fend out against this guy and by default, um, due to me having a really good water type, I'm actually able to damage this guy somewhat. And get a good chunk of HP. And I think this was intentional. So we go <laughs> slam, cool. Really? I mean, this much shop would have been the greatest thing to ever not been lost. I'm, I'm honestly considering to keeping it out of um, out of spite, out of uh, me being so dumb. But we'll see what I do. No, gotta stay the challenge. In the grass. What is it? Ooh, a Joltek. That's that's interesting. Y'all think it's not all that bad? Just gonna be really, really careful though. Oh, it has bug bites, that's awesome. And Fury Cutter. Ooh, nimble. Don't kill him. He is our ticket to victory. Not taking any chances here. The only thing going against me with Yaltic is I know it 
It evolves to Galvantula in, in its level 30s. So Jaltic is not necessarily like the perfect Pokemon, but for what we're about to do. I call you Cyper. But what we're about to do, I'll just tell you guys this. I'll I'll take any positive trait I can get. So that was not all that bad. Anyway, thank you as always for everyone for joining and um Join us next episode where we're going to go through the farm and potentially get that grass gym badge. Thanks for joining and have a great day everyone. Bye.